As Halloween approaches, one of the more spectacular things to see in our area is the annual great jack-o'-lantern blaze in Westchester County. Thousands of silly and scary jack-o'-lanterns are on display. CBS 2's Matt Kozar live at Van Cortlandt Manor in Croton on Hudson with the whole story. Hey, Matt. Hey, Maurice and Christine, some interesting carvings. We showed you this one of the CBS 2 pumpkin. We'll be bringing that one back to the newsroom. About a dozen people are responsible for carving thousands of pumpkins here at the great jack-o'-lantern blaze. They're hard at work right now for this unique fall spectacle. It goes for 28 nights. It's in its 10th year, its 10th anniversary. The blaze is held at Van Cortlandt Manor near the Croton train station. 4,000 people show up every night for this haunted walk past some innovative and creative designs. Many of the carved jack-o'-lanterns are set up around Van Cortlandt Mansion, which, listen to this, dates back to the 1750s. Michael Natiello is the creative director. He's the brain behind this unique event. So we're looking at traditional symbols of Halloween, like skeletons or black cats. But we also try to tap into the history, as I mentioned with the legend of Sleepy Hollow, and even with some of the carvings. So we have carvings of the people who used to live here. Now it gets dark here in about an hour's time and that's when all of this will be lit up. It will look just spectacular. The walk takes about 45 minutes. All the proceeds go back to the museum. You'll have until November 16th to check it out. Reporting live in Croton in northern Westchester, Matt Kozar, CBS 2 News. Okay, Matt, those look like totem poles, right? They really do. They really, really do. Cool. There's some talented artists there. Extremely. I cannot carve the pumpkin. No, <laughs> cannot I could drop a pumpkin and <laughs> crack it open. Yeah. <laughs> Which I did over the weekend, but anyway. <laughs>